Hey, Matt Morris, welcome to the Unemployed Millionaire Show. And I had to record a quick show on something that um, I didn't quite realize was as much of a problem as it really is. You see on my uh, Facebook, I put a question and um, I said, Network Marketers, what's the number one thing you need help with in growing your business? And so what I asked for was, what do you need help with? What do you need to grow your business? And what's fascinating is so many people sent me messages and so forth saying, the number one thing that's holding me back is this. And uh, you may not think that is a big deal, but I got to tell you what I personally believe is, you know, where energy goes, where attention goes, energy flows. And if you're focusing on constantly what you don't have, you're going to end up getting more of it. If you're focusing on what you need, you'll get more of that. And so I'll give you an example. Um, you know, in my life, I've got, uh, for compliance reasons, I don't want to tell you how much money I'm making, but it's a good amount of money. And the question that I'm asking myself is not why am I only making this much money? It's how can I make a million dollars a month? What kind of value do I need to give to my organization, to give to the network marketing community? How can I be of so much value to other people that I can earn a million dollars a month? And so if you notice the difference between that, if you're focusing on what's not working, there's no solution there. If you're focusing on what's holding you back, and you know, there's no solution there. The solution lies in what's gonna get you to where you wanna go. And that may sound very subtle, but I got to tell you what I have really realized is success, and I don't want to get airy-fairy here. I'm not an airy-fairy kind of guy, but success is a, a vibration. It's an energy that you put out. It's the moxie that you have, and it's abundance mentality versus a scarcity mentality. You know, Tony Robbins, um, you know, he talks about the quality of your life is based on the quality of the questions that you ask yourself. And if you ask yourself a question like, why am I stuck in this situation? Guess what? That's a low frequency. That's low energy. That's lack. That's scarcity versus thinking, what exactly do I need to do to achieve my goals? That is an abundance mentality. That's a higher vibration. You're going to have um, you, you know, more power and more enthusiasm and creativity is going to come because what's interesting is I've been asking my, myself, how can I make a million dollars a month? I've been asking myself that multiple times a day. You know, it's, it's the question that consumes me is how can I provide so much value to other people that I can earn a million dollars a month? And see, I'm some of you are going to look at this and think, wow, he's so materialistic. And, um, you, you know, for me, it's almost not just the money. It's being able to provide that kind of value. See, the wealthy of the world, the reason why they're wealthy is because they figured out how to provide an incredible amount of value to other people. You look at Mark Zuckerberg. Mark became a billionaire because he provided incredible value to us, uh, a means to communicate, inter, you know, social interaction, entertainment. And so he deserves to be a multi-billionaire because he's provided a huge value. You know, the founders of Google, uh, they provided a huge value to all of us. And so they became multi-billionaires. And so, you know, what I want to get across to you is this. Stop asking yourself and stop saying, you know, what's holding me back or this is holding me back. Focus on where you need to go and what you need to do in order to improve your situation. And I'm telling you, it will make a difference. And what you focus on improves. And get this, if you're always focusing on what is holding you back, your lack, your scarcity, if you're focusing on that, guess what you're going to get? Subconsciously, you're going to get more of that. But if you're always focused on what do I need to do to do this, your subconscious mind, even when you're, you know, if you're asking that question over and over, your subconscious mind is working even when you're not thinking about that. And I got to tell you, I've been coming up with idea after idea after idea. My motivation has increased since I started asking that question about two weeks ago. And, you know, it's just interesting how when you're focused on where you need to go versus where you are, how things just pop up, things just appear. It's like I'm getting calls from people. I'm getting ideas. My mind 
mind is opening up, all because I'm asking the right questions. So my friends, ask yourself the right questions, the empowering questions, not the disempowering questions, and watch what happens. Appreciate you tuning in. If you feel like this can add some value to some others, definitely share it around. You can tag people in the post. Love to hear your comments. And if you haven't subscribed to mattmorris.com, hop over there and subscribe. You'll get a special training that I recorded for you there. Thanks so much. Go make life an adventure. Oh, 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 oh,